Hey guys, this is Top Rock PT at your service. Let's start. So, last episode, we did some recon and some little plans here and there to get one of the clock reports off the train. So, without further ado, we are going to do that. Uh, I think Bentley was going to begin this, right? Yeah. Okay. Right. Um, what did we have? Health extractor. Um, well, we have the size destabilizer. I think we're going to do the health, uh, capture enemies and extract medicine from them. Um, okay, so I, I do throw it. This one, whacking. Uh, okay. No, that's not what I, no. Nope. Alright, whatever. That's not what I meant to do, but anyways. Alright, how in the heck am I going to get up there? Oh lord. Yeah, how am I supposed to get up there? <laughs> oh, there we go. According to this timetable, Iron Horse number one should be passing by any time now. I see it. It's moving awfully fast. Just jump on the caboose and go in through the hatch. Piece of cake. Alright. Let's see here. And there we go. Ta-da. Well then... For a train, it's bigger on the inside. Ooh. Okay. Yep. Okay, easy. All right. Thanks, some coin. Is that Canadian coins? I just realized that. <laughs> oh God, we don't need eagles. Listen. Wait, we saw that trigger bomb, right? They won't ever know. Boom. Throw that and bombs away. Go to sleep. Just go around them. Like that. We are sneaky as a turtle. Alright. Skip over those guys. Alright. So far, so good. Oh! Oh! Okay. Oh, okay. Easy. There we go. All right, shimmy, shimmy. Pretty easy. You know, let's leave them a gift, shall we? <laughs> nice, all right, and we'll take some coins out of that too. All right, I had to do that, it was worth it. Oh, we took the long, that looked like the heart or something. Alright, pretty easy. Things are going great. We've already stolen one of Jean Basson's three clockwork parts. However, Iron Horse 2 and 3 are going to be a little tougher to crack. First, I'll need to hop aboard Iron Horse 2 and do a little preemptive RC chopper strike to clear out the air defenses. Once cleared, it'll be up to Sly to work his magic in the interior to get at that second clockwork lug. 
Murray, you'll need to trap some of the local bear cubs in order to unlock a nearby hand car. We're gonna need it to catch up with Iron Horse number three. But don't worry, the cubs won't be hurt. Although I can't say the same for the guard. Alright, cool. Alright, so would that mean Bentley would go again, since it's the aerial soul? Yeah, okay. Alright, let's see here. Oh no, that's not what I meant to do. No, 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 that's not what I meant to do. I meant to smack him with the um, crossbow. No. Bad. Alright, keep running, keep running. Where's this one? Up there? All right. Oh, I can't use any more. Okay, that's okay. We set this on. There we go. And sadly, I cannot make that jump. Okay. Oh, ow, jeez. Oh lord. Okay. Ow. Okay, I can take the hits. Come on, Bentley. Come on, Bentley. You can take it. You can take it. Keep running. Keep running. Keep running. Keep running. <laughs> there you are. Come on. Almost there. And there we go. Heads up, Bentley. Here comes Iron Horse number two. You and that RC chopper of yours ready? We'll get the job done. Provided I can catch up with that train. You get out of here. No. Oh, this is going to be a close one. And. Okay, cool. Made it to number two. Heck yeah. making it through this train unless I neutralize the aerial defenses. Good thing I outfitted the RC chopper with a new cannon. Let's see. The X button drops bombs and the square button shoots forward. Oh, I love doing this. Okay, this control is way much easier. Okay, I'm okay with that. Oh, Lord. All right, nope. I forgot what the game was called, but like I love these type of games because you could just like spray like crazy. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Bentley, why didn't you equip the cannon before? Because you could do stuff like this. Bombs away. Bombs away. Nice try, you're not gonna get me. Alright, come on, keep dropping bomb. Oh, okay, that was one hit. Alright, I'm not paying attention, getting overly hype, but it's okay. I got this. Oh. Alright. Okay, we got one. Come on, man. Boom. I mean, this helicopter has some LJ. Uh, uh, <laughs> I cannot speak today. <laughs> Graceful movements. There you go. I'll probably recover myself with that. All right. All right. Oop. Nope. All right. Come on. Almost there. Oop. Oh, Lord. Okay. I'm not liking this. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I am a god in RC helicopters. I wish I could, like, I wish I could actually fly one. This is it. The final stretch. Is I know I flew a drone. And that was a little 
nerve-wracking because you have a million, like not a million, what I'm talking about, at least over a thousand dollar drone. <laughs> oh lord, yeah, no, you, it gets nerve-wracking because if you break that thing, you're just like, there's nothing you can do. <laughs> All right, that was a short job. I kind of not anticipated that. All right, um, all right. Uh, what do I got left? Uh, it's the Murray one. Okay. Wait, can I actually put that bear to sleep? I'm kind of curious. Oh lord. Uh, no, that is a affirmative no. You cannot put that bear to sleep. Mama, Mama bear is going to stay up and probably possibly kill you. And is that a glacier moving? Huh. Well, we are in Canada. A. Eh? Yeah, actually, I think a little fun fact. Um, what's up? Oh, okay, instead of getting shot at, thank you. Okay, Bentley, come on. Just zigzag it, zigzag it, zigzag it. Go in the base, go in the base, go in the base, go in the base. Alright, there we go. Alright, now to Murray. Alright, so we got Inferno Flop. Uh, we got the Atlas. Okay, so we'll do the Inferno Flop with R1. No, no, no. L1. That's the Turbuckle Jump. And then that's the. F okay. Boom. All right, listen, Boos. Gonna steal your Canadian coins or currency. Oh, I didn't even real. Okay, <laughs> I didn't even realize the sly one was right there. I didn't even notice. All right. Uh, I have to get up there. And Carmelita is right there. I'm not liking that. Carmelita, go away. Go away. Go away. What was her in the pose? Oh, Lord, the train's right behind me. Did I just get killed by the train? <gasps> oh, my God. Oh my god. That was a thing. Okay, I, I'm ashamed of myself now. <laughs> just drop controller and stop recording. Just, I, I'm done. <laughs> okay, well this time I'm gonna do it. Holy crap, I didn't realize that that was gonna happen. Are you telling me the train's right behind me again? No, okay, I was gonna say. We'll be in this hand car to chase down Iron Horse number three. But for the time being, it's all fenced in. No problem. I'll tear that fence apart. A metal's too resilient for my bombs or your muscles. So for this job, we're going to have to rely on a stronger force. The love of a mother or her child. Uh you got something to tell me? I get ya. That big mama bear will be able to smash the fence no problem to free her cubs. That's correct. Beware, cubs, for you are hunted by the Murray. <laughs> by the Murray. <laughs> Alright, where's the first one? Oh, the first one's over here. Okay, well that's convenient. The only tedious part is I'm guaranteed they're making noise, right? Oh lord. Bear cub. Oh 
Okay, hold on. Shata. No, bear cub, where are you? Oh, okay. Who? Listen, Carmelia, you could just go somewhere else. We're not your enemy here. I'm low on health right now, too, which isn't great. Like, I need to get in here. Okay, is there any health in here? Nope. Figures. Okay. Give me health. No! <laughs> I was about to fire fist you. No. Knock it off. I hate dying. It's always with... It's always been this level, too. Okay, he's gone. I'm at least gonna have the fire fist on. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, God. Alright, three, two, one. Go, 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 go. No one notices anything. Just taking a bear cub. That's all. All right. Hope they don't get run over by that train. <laughs> I noticed they were on that train, but anyways. Uh, let me look at the time here. We got time for one more. I, I'm, I'm actually surprised with the two dads that we actually still have time for, like, another one. Alright. I think it's Sly now, right? Alright. Double check on Sly. Um... We can try that music box for the time being. Alright. Alright, speed up. Alright, do 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 do. Oh lord! <laughs> oh my god, I almost ran into that. Alright. Speed up, speed up, speed up, and showtime. Cover got ran over my train. <laughs> I would not like that. Okay, you got anything in your pocket? Yes, you do. Alright, let's get some stuff. Oh my god, that's uh that's a little too close. And we'll take that topaz off of you. Thank you for your services and sorry John Zon, but I just took you guy out. Alright. Um, okay, uh, I'm gonna ignore you. Okay, why can't I get up? Okay, there we go. Sly, the second iron horse train is coming too fast. You might not have time to jump on top. Relax, Bentley. There's more than one way to get on top of that caboose. Perfect. All right. All right, this should be a little bit easier since I'm sly. Can I like... Okay. You got anything in your pockets? Oh, you got something in your pockets. Stand perfectly still. Just let me take everything. Alright. Uh. Run! Oh. Oh, okay. We're good, we're good. Go around. You don't see anyone. Move back, move back. Oh, 
Actually, let me see if there's anything coins in here. I'm kind of actually kind of curious since we're already back here. Oh, baby, that's a lot of coins. Nice. See, Canada's where it's at to get money. Oh, Lord. Okay. No, the music box. Come on. Okay. Okay, it's time to run. Let's go. Okay. Yeah, they're not getting through that. Okay, everyone, let's just uh, make this not stealthy as possible. Okay. Okay, come on. Oh, lordy. Okay, almost there, almost there, almost there. Oh, lord. <laughs> oh, my god. <laughs> that went south so fast. Oh, my god. <laughs> I don't care if I over talked over that cutscene. Oh my god. <laughs> I smash, like, no, no, not even smash. I hit one guard and it okay, triggers guys, all of them. This is it. Time to break into Iron Horse number three and carry away the clockwork stomach. Now, the train's moving too fast to jump onto here in town, so we'll have to catch up with it on Murray's new hand car. Once we're in position, Sly will hop aboard and make his way up to the engine. While he travels through the interior, I'll provide air support with my RC chopper. I've planned this as a textbook trade robbery. If we all do our jobs right, what could possibly go wrong? Don't ever say that. Coming from me, I always say that. <laughs> and something always goes wrong. I don't know why. Just It's like karma like really does exist. Anyways, uh, let me double check the thief net. Um, yeah, again, we probably won't get anything. Silent obliteration, that'll come in handy. But um, we'll sell those. All right. I think I'm sly, I'm pretty sure. When No, we're Murray. Huh. That's weird. All right. You can follow me real fast. Thank you. Alright, and off we go. Hop aboard, guys. We've got a train to catch. Got it. Strong work, Murray. Yeah, sure. The Murray's strength knows no limit. You're on, Sly. Break into that train and steal the clockwork stomach. That John disarmed one strange guy. The claw gang divides up the clockwork parts, and he walks away with his stomach and lungs? It still creeps me out. Get creeped out later when we aren't riding an antique hand car at breakneck speed. Good point. It's time for a train robbery. Alright, so this time hopefully we don't trigger all the guards, which just in case, again, making sure we have the music box. Okay. Can I even... Oh, perfect. This works. How far does that go? Okay, go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. There we go. What? No! <laughs> That's garbage! <laughs> you nodded your head off! That's a load of garbage! <laughs> that was a load of garbage! <laughs> okay. Just in case. Actually, I just face palm for one minute. We were supposed to end the episode. <laughs> um, <laughs> I just realized that. Um, <laughs> well, uh, there's no going back now. Uh, sorry for the long episode, but um, we'll, we'll see what we can do. <laughs> I got overhyped that we were like doing so well. Oh my god, I just realized that.
Okay, well... Sorry guys, it's a long episode, but... Oh lord. Right, and I'm walking right past you. Hey, Cooper, fun might find you here. Just can't stay away from these clockwork pops, can you? Oh, I just do it to meet exciting ladies like yourself. If you'd like some excitement, why not climb up on top of the train? I'm sure to get your heart pumping, maybe even show you my new ride. No thanks, Neela. I've seen enough already. What's the problem, Poodle? Afraid you can't take me on. Have to call up your little friends for help. Come in, little friend. Neela's got me pinned down. Any chance of air support? I've already launched the RC chopper. She won't know what hit her. Come on, Cooper. Let's play. What in blazes? All right, little RC friend. This should be a quick bit of destruction. All right. All right, let's see what I got here. How fast my trigger finger is. Oh, okay. Come on, baby. This shouldn't take too long. Hey, come on. Oh. That was some fancy flying, little friend. Whatever you say. I gotta look back in that record this recording how long that took. Oh my god, that was like really fast. Alright. Go sleep. Go sleep. Go sleep. Thank you. a whole lot of ducks. Oh my god. Oh lord, that's that's already scaring me. Okay. Oop. Yeah. Okay. Come on. We got this tie. We got this. No! Come on, just hit the hook! How is it hard to hit a hook? Okay, thank you. We're almost there. Just turn around, Moose. Just let me through. Alright, and Booyakasha. Just hit all these coins. Yep, that's a lot of coins. Alright, come on, Ty. We got some work to do. Oh, wait, is that the heart right there? No. Okay. Oh no. Oh, uh, okay. Yo! I'm tired of these guards. I'm tired of everything. Get me the lung. <laughs> Neela, I thought I already told you I could just do this all day with making sure you don't get the po Oh lord, okay, missiles? Okay, you didn't tell me you had missiles. 
Come on. Almost there. Oh, okay. Watch out. Ooh, one more hit like that. And I'm a goner. Meant to say the Star Wars, the Clockwork stomach. <laughs> I've got an upset stomach on my hands, but other than that, I feel great. All right, <laughs> job complete. Also, apologize again for continuing. <laughs> the gang and I had pulled off the impossible. We'd successfully robbed all of John Bassan's iron horse trains, and we were walking away with three. Count them: three Clockwork parts. And as a bonus, we shut down spice distribution in all of North America. Needless to say, we were pretty pleased with ourselves. Can't say the same for Carmelita. Once again, the framed policewoman had to run from the cops. Which was fun at first, but I'm starting to feel a little sorry for her. I mean, what if they replaced Carmelita with someone else? I don't want another cop on my tail. She's a big part of why this is all fun. Sooner or later, I'm going to have to figure out a way to clear her name. Some way other than turning myself in. Okay, and that deals with that episode. So then now we got uh, episode 7. Okay, it has... Okay, that's going to be interesting. Either way, I'm going to end the episode off. This is Type 50, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.